Hello and welcome to some more Transport Fever 2 gameplay. It's the... I'm just going to say it's the European series, even though this is tiny and entirely British, but roll with it. Next series, we'll actually do different things. Uh, it's been a fair while since I uh, last did this. And when I left you, we'd pretty much fiddled with this part of the northern section of the map and got some of the freight moving. Still got a, a bit of a problem with traffic down this end of the world. You can see it's... We're, 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 we're backing up quite exponentially at this stage of proceedings. I mean, just look at it. But I've, I've made life easier for them, and they're still just choosing to... Well, just look at it. Look, they all want to go down here. Look, I've done this. Lads. It's there. I mean, you, you could... I suppose I've not really made life easier for them, so I'm not giving them much of a junction to go off of the motorway. Um, hmm. Maybe I should have thought about that, unless I do... Well, they can run... No, you see, even if I want to get them... Okay, yeah. Well, there we are then. Uh, right, I've been playing um, before I got this uh, set up. Um, you actually joined me at Hull initially. Uh, that will be the scene of a, a fair bit of work because um, I want to do like a... I said I want to do the, you know, the Cardiff Valley Tram. My plan actually is to get a tram from Hull, Hatfield, Stourbridge, Derby, into Cardiff and into Camelford. I'm also planning on running an intercity bus service from Hull, Wellington Garden City, Camelford, Bocklington, Bedford, into Ross on Y. I then bring your attention to Tring as a 747 graces our screens. Hello. Uh, yeah, Tring is absolutely ridiculous. I've also been spending a lot of money. And the reason for this will become quite apparent when I come down to Chester. Right. If I go here, I come down a bit. If I zoom in, right, I'm going to sit here for about, I'm going to give it a couple of minutes and we're just going to see what does and doesn't turn up. I think you'll all approve of what does and doesn't turn up. I've changed the, um, I've upgraded the liveries on the, the trains as well, so if a class 321 is about to depart, you'll see that I've um, changed it from this metro colour scheme to something more uh, upmarket for the East Coast Main Line. Ah, also, a silent GNER HST just works past us. So you can see what I've done with the HSTs, so you can pretty much gather what I've done with the Class 91s as well. Interesting how it's a silent HST. Bearing in mind they still have the Valenza engines inside them. This is when things start now getting interesting, because I've really now gone for a complete mixture of old and new. Ah, First Capital Connect Class 321 is now leaving. Excellent. And you'll see Transpennine Express Class 800 coming in. That also gives you an indication as to what I've done for the rest of the Transpennine network. So, if I now do go back to my original camera position, excellent. Uh, what else, where else can I look? And I can show you what I've been doing to you. Ah, yes. I think you'll like this. Filthy that is. <laughs> wow, that is. That's either really dirty or the textures haven't quite loaded in, but you can basically see what I've done. I've done a 68 on there. Um, let me 
just see if I can't edit that because um, those 68s are absolutely filthy. So, no, I want diesel, you berk. 67s, no. Right. Boom, 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 boom. You chose that one. Go with that one, because that one's probably going to be a tad cleaner. Then you have to go to your multiple unit box, all the way down to there. Okay, right. Uh, now, let's just have a look. Ah! Much better. And then... I need to then find the other route. Is this the one in question? Or is that the one with the 800s on it? Bear with me. Nope, that's the one with the 800s. So, which route is it? Squeaky. And then, ah, this is the one. This is the kitty in question. Transpennine class 350s. I can hear a HST. The sound fails to load. Excellent. That 321 is waiting for clearance onto the line. We'll go and find a 225 set if I've got one doing the round somewhere. Speak of the devil. Nope, that's a HST. Uh, find the 225s. You're 114. Are you what I want? No, you're underground. Are you what I want? Ah, you are. Excellent. Right, here we go. There goes the 91. Excellent. And then I think that did it. In fact, no, I tell you, I've also done a change to the Great Eastern Main Line. Uh, purely on the intercity side of life. I've upgraded it from Anglia to intercity livery. Still working with the 86. Now with a full complement of Mark III's and a DVT. We're also going to ignore the fact that I've actually left the um, the branch line service with the old steps. Oh, look at that. We've then got the DVT leading. So it's actually good. You've got a mixture of the two working in tandem. There she goes. Uh, right, that will be it. Oh, actually, no, it isn't. No, I've also done one other thing, and then I'll actually get to the meat and veg of what I'm doing today. I have been getting some more mods, and here it is. I've gone and got myself a rail tour. It's a bit jittery, I must admit. I should have actually uh, really gone flying around the map and loaded everything in first before trying to do these shots, but there we go. I've also been really busy with the airport. I've gone and put... Every single terminal now has a line. So airplanes are now flying all over the gaff. But what I wanted to do today... Ah, here we go. So yes, come on, load the map in. 
just uh, keep running back and forth, let it just sort itself out, because you've got a lot of moving objects in here now. Just run it around. You wouldn't think I've been about 15, 20 minutes on here, would you? So I've not actually gone across the entirety of the map just to fiddle. But yes, the, what I'm doing today is building the Midland Main Line. So if you'll remember, uh, we actually started to build the spur out from Whitby just to give me a fighting chance, where we're then connected to Ash, and it's already connected from Ash to you know, the main network. From Ash, sorry, from uh, from Whitby, I was then going to run to where was I going to run? Probably. How did the Twyford? It's ridiculous. I was going to run from Whitby to Whaley Bridge. Uh, from Whaley Bridge, I will then run straight to uh, Derby. From Derby, it will then probably run to uh, Starbridge. Uh, Starbridge to Hatfield and then into Hull. So it's not going to be a very big route, but uh, I'll probably only have one intercity stop during this. If I know I've got two, I'll have Ash, I'll have three actually. Ash, Whitby and Derby. Everything else will be for little commuter trains. So, that is what we're going to be doing today. I have no idea how long this is going to take, so uh, you probably want to get yourself a drink or two for your viewing pleasure. Uh, what I'll also do, before um, once I've built the middle of the main line, obviously get the trains running, I'm going to upgrade the trains on the west coast, so they actually go to... I'm going to skip Intercity Swallow, I'm going to go straight to Virgin Trains, so we've got some more modern running around. Uh, and then I'm going to do another probably 10 minute section at the end of the film where, because everything's going to be running, I'm going to be sat probably somewhere like here. Probably sit here and you can see, see all the comings and goings from every single station here as an 800 comes in for Transpanine Express. Uh, yeah, so let's get ready. I'll also have I've also got a song uh, lined up, Admiral James T sixty six, one of my personal favourites from the collection. So we'll listen. We'll start off with that when I uh, do my spotting. I'm also going to mute the sound on my laptop because I noticed that the microphone was picking up the in game as well as so the music wasn't actually as good as I hoped it was going to be for you guys. So this time I'm going to be muting it at my end. So it doesn't pick up, the audio doesn't work my side, but the in, it still captures the in-game music. Uh, who are you? Beaconsfield Hopper, you're an A380. Right, so let us crack on. So, uh, that is the Midland Main Line, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because you've not done anything with that, so you actually need that to now make everything else electrified, so let's start doing that. I am going to run with... Um, Electrification. Or do I run it? Do I have the middle of main line purely? I actually might have the middle of main line purely diesel, actually, to be fair. So I'll just make sure I've not actually. Uh, Done anything there? Do, 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 do. Follow that round. Follow that in. Follow that in. Right, I've got to zoom in for this one. Coming in, coming in, coming in. That's all diseaseled. Excellent. Okay. Right, back up again. Uh, right. Yes. Here we are. Right. Let's fiddle with this. Lovely. Okay. I mean, just look at Whitby, Matt. That's ridiculous. The AI have actually really... They've been busy. They've they've done this while I've been away. I think it's fantastic. I just love how the AI have incorporated my road and they're just like, yeah, you know, we'll build on this. I mean, look at it! The airport's busy. Train station will be busy when the... When the, when the Woodland? Yeah, I bet it's the Woodland main line, apparently, but there we are. Right, so let us get a wriggle on. Now, you've got to express that side. 
Have you got express this side? No, nope, you need to do express this side. Well, not express, high speed. You can actually have it all as high speed. Yeah, because most modern commuter trains don't just run at 75 miles an hour. Yep, but they do in my world. Uh, right. Boom. Boom. Okay, right, lovely. This is going to be an absolute nightmare. Okay, let's begin. Interesting how it's climbing straight away, but it's not colliding or anything, which is good. Okay, alright, I can work with this. But if it's climbing, where's it actually going to try and come out? Interesting. Let's have it go down by one, so the climb isn't as severe. Do the same here. Just have it follow on as much as possible. I want to try and avoid... Oh, I've gone for a bog standard tunnel that one. Do you know what? That's actually fine. It's alright. Uh, oh, that was the Mark III set leaving. Yeah, I'll, I'll get these all changed afterwards. I should, have, I should have done it at the start, but now you can see what I go through. You can see the method in your madness. Right. So, it comes out. I'm not too worried about scrubbing speed. So I need to... Well, it's going to be losing speed in this initial section anyway, so I'm not too concerned. What if... I had that flat? No, it's going to collide with that, so you actually need it to be... You do need it to be high. Alright. Well, we'll give it a modern... Uh, span. We'll just keep following it along. I can actually then have the span go flat after that, so it's just that initial climb in. Okay. And don't want it too low because you need to clear the river we can keep the height but you will need to oh you have to really do something about this you have to probably come round and you might have to come over you might have to have that as a quite a lengthy bridge I'll tell you what let's keep it how are we doing on that front how, level, how flat does that go to the sea line Tell you what, let's have that go down by one. Right, let's just okay. Right, let's plumb that. Let's just have that as the one. Let's just do this as a test. How low is that going? No. Okay, so it needs to go. The arch effect does work. I quite like that. That could actually work because it's it's high enough for the ships to pass under. I'm sure. So let's just. See, why do something like this? I'm not overly convinced. I've got cargo ships coming in as well, which is a lot of shipping in there. Well, okay, what have you went up by one? Oh god, what have we just done there? We've done something. Right, let's abandon that idea. So let's. Right, okay. Right, let's then do... Keep it on the level, because that actually that might make my life a little bit more easier. Right, okay, let's, let's keep it at that. It's going to be quite curvy. That's already got... Yeah, it's got so much more height already. So let's have it then run across this way. I'll come back to the commuter line in a minute. Yeah, I can really tell that's much, much better. Right. Let's 
something like this, right? How? Okay, you can actually you can have that as coming down. That should then reach there without any issues. Okay. Right, back to this one. Oh, have I done this entire thing with catenary? Oh, for God's sake. Oh, mind you, did I say I was having catenary on them? No, I'm having it as un as unelectrified. Will I ever upgrade the middle and main line? Nope, I'm actually going to have it as diesel the entire time. It does, however, mean that uh, whilst the rest of the railway will actually look modern with the trains running, it does mean you're going to be limited when it comes to your commuter trains. You've not got many for diesel, unless no, because if you if you do what you're about, if you do what you if you go through with that particular plan, there will be men with pitchforks requesting a chat, and it will be a chat that will not be overly pleasant. Plan was to actually, instead of the middle of main line being British, have it as, as German, but because you've got loads of German stuff you can actually utilise, yes, I could do that. It would be it would be good because I could actually call this the European series because I've got something European in there. Cha Ching. But um no, I'm gonna stay true to form. Do you actually know what your next series is gonna be? I probably flirted with it before, I've probably mentioned it in uh, passing, but I've never actually I don't think I've actually gone into great detail what it's gonna be. Are you actually gonna do you actually know what you're doing? I think so. I can't remember what I was actually gonna do. I've probably got it in a, in a few earlier episodes going, yeah, this is what I'm going to be doing. Never actually going to follow through with it, but I think I know what I want to do. Nope. Oh, do come on. Now is not the time for you to do this. I'm not responding. Come on. This way. Stop. Stop. Just come off it. Come over here. Oh, you know what? Right, fine. You're being awkward. Come on. Yes. And there. Yep. Right, and down by one. Beautiful. Right, now that's going to Let's see if this wants to actually just work. It may work. It does scrub off a lot of speed, but I can live with that. So the exact same thing. Right, let's just come down. How does that look? That actually looks hideous. So do you now then actually change your bridge style? No, what you do. Is you just do manual placements. So it doesn't join unnecessarily. So do something like that. Right, let's do shift. This is going to look all manners of absolutely hideous. I don't like that. So what, I'll tell you what we do. So what I'm going to do, just to make my life a little bit easier with icons, I'm going to I'm turn the icons off. Is that any better? No. Okay, let's drag 
that out to there. That's better. Okay, well, the difficult part is sorted right now. Um, it's amazing, suddenly you've actually forgotten what you want to do because you've now lost everything, but you can see the planes. You've got, that's a DHL plane. That should be a 747. Yep, Central Belt Skyways, jolly good. Um, what, do you, blimey, you've actually forgot where you're gonna go. Um, help. <laughs> what do I need? Towns. There we go. Right, I've not got the towns on there, I'm safe. So it was Whaley Bridge. Yeah, Whaley Bridge to Derby. So, you're coming out from there. Whaley Bridge is going to have... It's got three train stations already, and you're going to add another one into it. Yep. So, you need to remember, you've got your intercity line on that side. Okay, well, I can... I can fiddle around with that. How long do you want your platform? Uh, we'll go, whoops, it's standard, two lengths, 160 meters for a commuter train. Diesel. Yeah, why not? Catenary, no. Uh, right, you actually need it this size. You need to have the, oh, hold on. It's going to come out and then probably up through what's the elevation change like yeah, it's actually not as bad as I thought um, unless you have it as an elevated station it's the only way you can get around it just got to be cautious of the railway line Okay, well, let's try it. Two, 160, height, 15, pillars normal. How does a 15 height station look? Yep, okay, I can work with that. So let's stick it there. Um, elevated station. Needs to be this side. Connects onto the road. Excellent. Okay. Still need to configure it. Wally. Right. Elevated tracks. High speed. Okay. It's interesting. I'm going to have to. Whoops. Tracks. I wonder. I know what this J slab, but. Still wants bridge pillar collision, really? Okay. I presume then it's because you're colliding with the building. Sorry. Let's just, just try again. What's this? Station Square. Uh. Right, I didn't know you could do that. Still bridge pillar collisioning. Okay, so improvise. We'll get rid of the road and we can just build a new one in. Not a problem. So I just deleted that poor man's business. Oops. And bizarre. Hopefully he will rebuild. If not, then I'm going to be getting a lawsuit coming through. So you demolished my business. Sorry. 
Okay, right, so that is climbing. You're not going to eclipse that, are you? Thank God for that. Interesting, that's climbing sharply and it's still not breached a surf. Ooh, okay. This actually could look quite cool. Let's go with standard tunnel still. Do that. That's standard. There. There. Okay, we've breached the surface. Actually, I think you could you could be okay here. Let us go with. That's having the bridge flat. I may have to lower it to go around there, but that's fine. We're still going to go with modern architecture. Okay. Well, what have I got in terms of uh, height? So if I kept that, I could actually be could be low enough. Well, we'll soon find out. All right, let's just come around to see. Is that going to be low enough? Oh, it is. Well, I'll be. I am impressed. I really am impressed, but it does mean you're going to get the ugly when it splits. Oh, I know. But I quite like that. I quite like that it goes under the bridges. You... No, you can't. Mm, okay. Well, let's just... Let's see how it all look when it comes to splitting. I don't know. It may may give me something to work with. Whoops. Alright, let's go for that one. You are, again, you're scrubbing speed, but not too bad. It's a... I remember at the start of the series, you said you wanted to avoid bridges and a whole heap of tunnels where possible. And what have you got? Bridges and a whole heap of tunnels. Right, so if I were to... Just come off it, would you? Right, if I were to split that there for argument's sake, how does that look on there? Absolutely wretched. Okay, so the only way I can do this, realistically, is to have this... ...running side by side... ...with just a little bit of a gap in between. I'll tell you what you do. I'll tell you what you do. This is what you do. You look and all see what I'm got. I've got planned here. That's if this plan will work. If it does... Right. So, I then... Go... There. There. Okay. Right, so that's... That's fine, right, so I'll have it start here, and here, and then, hope this works. Really having to think about this, isn't it? Anyway, if I actually stop the game entirely, then it's not trying to run about a thousand things at once, and I might be okay. Right. Why don't I just think of doing this before? Stop the game and then start building things. Because you're an idiot. Well, yeah. Ooh, that's close. It's gone. Has that gone undone exactly what I didn't want it to do? 
No, it's... Well, the bridges have merged, but... <sighs> okay. Um... Right, stick that in there. Okay, no. All right, I'll have to do it the old I'll have to do it that way then. All right, let's just stick that in. We'll just race this along. It does mean there's going to be a lot of fiddling involved, but if I can just get one in, then we're fine. So I need to just make sure I delete the right one. There's probably far easier ways of building bridges, but uh, so this is just me being really awkward. Right, so I need to then bring you in. Excellent, right. We'll just have this following along. Right to so there. Okay. Now means I can bring you along. And then follow this. Okay. And again. Right. Back down here. Right. That actually does look very, very nice. Okay, so. Hopefully I can now do this. It doesn't want to merge. Yep, that's fine. Right, so it was then Whaley Bridge, and I'm running straight then down to Derby. I'll tell you what, the middle of Mainline is actually not going to be very long, is it? Ah, it's, it doesn't need to be, though. That's the thing. It doesn't need to be a long railway line. Right, so Derby was its next calling point, and that's already got... That's got two stations either side. Um, who's serving this at the moment? Transpennine Route East. Transpennine Route North. Okay, so it's only, it's only the Transpennine Routes that are working here. Well, was I having Derby as a... International, not international, big main station. I think I was. If I am, then maybe. Yeah, 350s do look good, don't they? 350, 402. I suspect they've all got 402. Yeah. Was there anybody over here? Not that I can see. Um, right, so how do you want to do this? Coming from Wayne Bridge, so you're going to want to come. Round under you got this what's this next day off? It's the food processing plant. Okay, well you got the height so you can go round and then not sure about that bridge, but you might be able to go through the pillars, through the mountain, and then because you're doing Derby to Starbridge, so you want to go in a straight line, really. So, what if you had your station right next to Derby, for that Derby Trans, whoops, Derby Trans Pennine, and this can just be Derby uh, West. Then you need to think, that's Derby Transpennine, you can just, create, just call this one Derby East. Or even just Derby, this one can just be just Derby. 240, 4, tracks are standard for the moment. Bom, bom, bom. Bom, like that. Do you want any slope on there? You can always replace the road in. Hold on, right, plumb that in. 
That is quite low down. Could you actually get away with having that? Oh, you could. You could actually use that as a tunnel. Okay. Right, because you're going there. Round and under. All right. This could. This could work. I trust this one's. Let's call this one Derby. It could work or it could not work. We're um. We'll soon find out. Have we got a bus service in Whaley Bridge? I must do, surely. Uh, no, it's just. Oh, it's the tram. Oh, of course, it's the tram. Yeah, I've got bus services in Whaley Bridge. Oh, that's fine then. Um, all right. Let's go with the commuter first, because that's going to be the problem. Right, so that is actually running flat. Okay. No, well, that road is ugly. Then does run over that. Bit of a lip. No, I don't like that. Good God. Okay, so that's actually... Um, okay. Oh, I can get I can get the bridge going. Ooh, yeah. No! Ah! Wrong button. Hotkey. No, bad hotkey. Stop pressing B. Right, I just forgot what you were doing there. Right. Oh, you just had it as well. Oh, no, 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 hold on. Right. Uh, it was something like that. Press that button. M. Okay, right. How are we doing height-wise for catenary? Oh, I like it. And this bridge allows for um, it allows it to be. You can create junctions on this bridge because it actually looks nice. I shall show you. So if we do something like you're not colliding, you're just being pedantic. Oh come on. Right, there we go. So you can see, because of the way the bridge works, it allows for nice junctions. Whereas the other one, it just it just doesn't work at all. So this bridge, if you want to build junctions on bridges, this is probably one of the best ones to do. Right, so okay, so I know that works. So then it's you. You may as well actually have these running... Uh, split for the moment because you're going to have to build that tunnel anyway so where is do, 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 something like that and then there we go bring it back a bit spiffing okay now the problem is it's getting the uh, line to play ball with that bridge probably it's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a lot of tunneling, I think, on this one. All right, well, let's let's just have this going around here. It's what 100, 118 miles an hour. What's the height on there? Will this will this bridge work with me? No, that bridge will not work with me. Do I want to rebuild that viaduct and have a new one in there? Yes. Standard catenary rock. I still want the uh, stoned archways, but I want one that's going to play ball. That's the same variation. Ah, that's better. That will play ball. That's, that's a nice one. Yep, that's fine. Beautiful. Okay, right, back to what I was doing. Something like that. Right, and then will this, if I do that, Okay, that is prepared to work with me. Excellent. No, stop it. Uh, right. Interesting how that's gone. It's gone down. I don't want it to go down. I want that to stay. Level, thank you. 
Right, and then... Ah, okay, it's got too much space in that pillar, so... Let's do... Whoops, nope. There we go. This could actually work in my favour quite nicely. So then, what if... Let's just do my usual crow flies method, and let's just find out what the game would be prepared to offer me for this. Sometimes doing this, the game can actually give you some really nice bits. So if I do that, right, we're too much slope on something, but it does give me my tunnel. But what are we too much sloping on? Have, have we hit another railway line and or a road? Okay, is that... We're also crossing over that, which isn't very good. So what if... Let's go down by one. No, down by two. Interesting. Well, it does allow it. So, are we actually... Are we good? We're good through there. We're good through there. This is a very long tunnel you've got. Well, okay. Very long tunnel it's going to have to be, then. I hope that when I build the other commuter one, that it's going to be just as good. The only problem being is because it's much wider out... I think it's going to try and cross over when it arches. It's going to probably give it a sharper one, or even a less sharper one, and cross over onto that. But we're going to find out. Right, let's just bomb this one. Let's see what it wants to do. I reckon that when I hook that to there, this tunnel is going to try and cross into that one. Uh, okay. I'm wrong, but, and this is the telling one, what is it going to do with, A, the motorway, and the other railway lines, railway lines, nothing, motorway, nothing, other railway line, nothing, brief little gap, do you know what, we'll take it for 19 and a half million dollars, I do like the little break in there, though. That's, that's pretty nice. Essentially, what you've built here is the channel tunnel for the middle of main line. I know that it would be a completely boring, you know, mod or something, but I'd love to, she'd love to see that someone either make a mod of the Le Shuttle terminal, the Eurotunnel terminals, or even just a mod of the Le Shuttle train. I don't know why, I just think it would be cool. Alright, so you're in Derby. You then want to go to Stourbridge, again, keeping the railway lines as they are. Do you know what? I've been planning this for a while. I'm not going to tell you guys. You can, you'll see it when I build it at a later date. But I'm going to put in a uh, proper intercity station. Not with catenary. High speed. Its purpose will be made clear at a later date. Right, so. Uh, how did you want to do that? So that is sloping down. You might have to make another tunnel here. In fact, what's, is there much in the way of sloping angle? Tell you what. Ooh, I don't really want to make too many tunnels, but if you you could actually just have it so it goes and over. Trying to go over or under. Tell you what, let us see what the game wants to do once more. I'm just curious. I'm not actually going to stick with what the game wants to wants to actually do. <clears throat> he says. Oh my god. What the hell? What town? Wait, 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 wait. Let's, let, 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 let's just dump that for a minute. Hold on. Right, we're in Derby. What the hell? How bad is this traffic? Well, there's your problem. Fiat 500 has been crushed by uh, Sophia Taylor crushing Thea Williams. What on my good God? 
What the hell? You can't... Are you all going to Derby? Surely not. You must be... Right, let's pick a name out of a hat. Let's go with Maria Evans. Yes, whistle. Industrial building. You're going to an industrial building in Derby. Okay, let's go with... Let's go with you. You're going to a commercial building in Derby? Waltham... Ah, you're going to Waltham Cross. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um... Oh god above. You want to create another ring you want to create a new ring road then. Okay. Uh this could actually make building that line a bit of a problem, but I need to try and cure this congestion. Let's go with there. Stick it straight to there. Beautiful. Do you actually want a bridge? No, you don't need a bridge for that. Right, that's now plumbed in. So, but the traffic going into Cardiff is minimal. Hey, just look at the traffic. Where, where are you going? <laughs> You're going to an industrial building in Derby. You're going to be late for work. Hopefully this little spur here um, will work. Right, anyway, let's go back to what I was doing. Let's just... Right, let's put this in, because the game did want to work with me, but I'm actually going to... No, I'm going to tell you I'm going to do this on my own. I want, I want to go through this cutting. So, if I had this going flat... No, stop it. Right, straight, flat, gives me bridge. Right, let's go with my personal favourite in case I have to start merging the railway lines. No, God. There we go. No, stop it. Marvellous. Okay, right. Um... How do you want to do this? If you kept going straight, will that clear the road? Yeah. Will that clear the Transpennine route? Well, once auto save decides to clear off. We'll do it. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Right. Uh, nice. No, no, no. Stop it. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Ooh. Oh, that has sufficient height. Okay, yeah. That's fine. Bit of a, I've got a bit of a curve, but not too bad. Welcome to Bridges Out. And today we're at Derby. Derby, not well known for its bridges, but there we go. To just stop it, would you? What are you doing? Why have you? All right, let's go. All right, shift. Come here. Do something like that. Thank you. All right. <clears throat> you need to actually make sure that the pillars aren't somehow. Digging into the road. Uh, well, I mean, it's not ideal, but, you know. Okay. So, let's now... To... The inside one. Okay. Seeing as my trains aren't going to be doing a... Hoo, 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 hoo. Can I, if I dump, no, sections are too big, what if I zoomed in, can I get rid of little, little snippety bits, no, I can get rid of little snippety bits, oh god, electric, thank you, um, How does it look if I went pillarless? I could actually get away with that. It's a big, big structure pillarless. Yeah, okay. Yeah, big, big concrete. Yeah, do you know what? That could actually, that would pass, I think. Keyword there is, I think. Uh... 
Okay, that one's fine. But what happens when I add in his friend? No. Okay, can I... Oh, I can. I can get rid of... That Look, that looks so much better. Right, so let's now do... Whoops. Let's do that. Pillarless. That looks better. Actually, that's the point then. Can I then actually do that with... Whoops. Right, now that I've got that big span in there, can I... Do... Right, I'll get rid of... That and that. Okay. Let's then chuck that in. Let's give that a pillar. That into there. Yep, that works. Okay. So now, bugger. Uh, okay, actually, no, 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 no. This could, this could work in my favour. How do you want to do this? Do you want to do a commuter line? Because that could be the one that causes some problems. So if the game sticks for this, it could do me a nice S bend. Let's find out if the game wants to give me an S bend. Oh, I've done this with the corner of the Right, let's just find out. S bend. Nice S bend. I have done it with a catenary. Hmm. I just go with a, go one of those tunnels. I can actually dump that road. I'll dump I'll, I'll dump the road and relay it. Uh, right, let's just quickly get rid of L catenary. Lovely. Okay. Uh, you. So in theory, the the high speed whoops. My speed line should then follow suit. Alright, so let's just dump the road. I can get back to it at some point, because the AI won't do anything with that particular area. Right, let's now grab you. Hopefully this will work just as well. Just follow it along, follow it along. Yep, carbon copy. Okay. See, that's what I like. I like that. When the game wants to work with you, it will work really, really nicely. When it wants to work against you, well, then we've got problems. Right. Have you got that as catenaried? Or did you... Hold on, what railway line are you having with that? More to the point, have you actually got them installed? Quick check of the scenario. Right. Give me a depot. Um, I want... I want diesel for this one. Just want to check. Okay, well you guys have now seen what I want to do. Because I've, I've just checked that to make sure that's all fine. Virgin Trains Cross Country. Beautiful. Don't have... Do I? No, I do, but I don't think I've got it as a set. Uh, bear with me. Uh, Mark Falls, no. No. It may be one I have to create myself. If it is, it's not a problem. What have I got in there? I've got cross-country variations for the uh, the 800, which I'll probably utilise because I'm just a sucker for that sort of thing. Okay, right. Hold on. Diesel. HSC power cars. I do have them. Right, that's fine. Right. Well, you know what I'm going to be doing anyway, but I'm not going to say anything. I'll just, if you were paying attention, you'll know. If not, have a quick look, or look back and uh, you'll soon see. Right, so. Uh, we've gone from Dalbury. D Dalbury? We've gone from Dalbury to Starbridge. Starbridge. See, that's what I want to do. I said Starbridge and Dalbury at the same time. So it was Starbury. Many, 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 many words to that effect. Right, so. Hatfield. Um, two, 160. Something like 
this level crossing over there? Yeah, why not? Right, Hatfield Annex. Really? Oh, of course, got a rubber station. There's another one. Right, tracks. High sped. It's amazing when you've got the game paused how much you can actually do in such quicker time because the game's not trying to load a thousand things at once. Right, let's just crow flies this one. Straight over. Again, that's a road I can actually just deal with at a later date. Right, now, where did you go for? That one. Wait, is he giving me a little tunnel? Oh, how cute. Oh, well, I'm keeping that then just for the... Just because. It's a cute little tunnel. Right, that road I will dump and uh, relay at some point. Whoops. And here we go again. Beautiful. Right. Our commuter should just do the exact same thing. Cute little tunnel. Spiffing. Beautiful. Okay. So, then it's just a run into Hull. And I need to go... Ooh, this could be a fun one. So how would that road play? I think I can allow for a level crossing on that road. So let's just do... I'm prepared to scrub speed on the approach. I can actually work and work that one. That's fine. And then I'm going to have the lines joined for the remainder of this route. So that can do that. That can do that. Again, I'm not too worried about losing speed in the approach into hole. That's not going to be a problem. Right, so you want to go, you can probably go under the motorway, under the motorway, under the railway line. Yep, that's underneath high speed once. Let's do something like that. Make sure you're not colliding. Nope, the tunnel should play ball. Right, let's just do that. Okay, that'll, that'll make things significantly easier for me. Beautiful. Hold on. Bear with me. I've just had my phones um, decided to have a thousand uh, things. Hold on. Oh, no. All as well. I just had about a thousand notifications all come through at the same time. Come on. Auto save. Just thank you. I really need to set out the interval. I keep saying this every episode. I'll do the interval. Never do. Why are you... Really? Come on. Have you actually worked out what you're going to do with, in terms of a diesel train for the commuters? Tell you what, I'm just going to... I'm going to anger everyone. I'm going to go... I am going to go continental. I'm going to bring some continental flavouring to the middle of the main line for the commuter trains. I'm going to have HSTs running for the express services. And we are going to go German for the commuter. Just to add some really odd bits of variety in. All right, so let's chuck you in there. Let's run you down. Suddenly, in the last five minutes, I've become the most popular man on Earth. My phone's never been alive so much. It's ridiculous. Right, come on. I'm so close to finishing. You've kept the ladies and gentlemen waiting for God knows how long because you've been, oh, for goodness sake, fiddling with this. Yes, I know. Don't shoot me. Oh, God, that could be tight. Beautiful. Right, down here. Oh, actually, okay, that's actually not as tight as I thought. I can actually get away with that. That... Oh, yes, okay. Yep, fine. I'll take it. Right. Should have done this as I was uh, going along, but at least you can see how I plumb in the uh, signalling. Right, so actually what I need to do is now go down to Lace and Buzzard. 
And I now need to go back into uh, trains, road vehicles, aircraft, ships, no costs, income, no, ah, signals. There we are. Right, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Right, so middle of main line was these two. And then the trains sit out there. And then the next batch of signals in. Here we go. Um, do you want... No. Let's just plumb the signals in, then worry about the whole music side later. What depot are you going to use for the middle of the main line? I'll probably use the one outside Ash. Okay, you've done the signals for that section, so let's go here. Lovely. Right. Down. Come on. And then here. No, you've... There we go. Right. Then here. Beautiful. Right. And then up here. Then in there. What diesels are you going to use for your German trains? I don't really know, but I'm really actually looking forward just to bringing in some continental variety into this. It's going to be strange that you're going to have German commuter trains coming into Derby when you're going to have, um, basically, you're going to have Grand Central running in as well. It's going to be so cool, though. Doop, be doop, doop, doop. Lovely. Bom, 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 bom. Ba, ba, da, dum, dum, dum. Ba, da, ba, dum. Da, dum, da, 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 dum, da, 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 dum. Yes, I know. Far too easy entertained. Don't shoot me. Don't come at me. Just leave me be. Right. Then I want... May as well have both signals out there. Okay, right. Make sure that Ash Depot is connected up to the middle of mainline network, which it is. What HST have you done here, by the way? BR Blue. Yeah, you need to change that. You should go to Intercity Swallow, really, for a little bit. Oh, okay. I'll do that. I'll go Intercity Swallow, then we'll do Virgin Trains West Coast. Sound good? Yeah. Right, let's now... I'll tell you what. Let's go and press play. Right, let's now let the game sort itself out. I also want to have a quick little cheek peek over at Derby. I just want to find out how the citizens are going to react to this road. It's this section here. It's literally just this junction that's caused all the problems. So I trust that people will now start using this. It's now traffic light control, so it's not going to ease the congestion anytime soon. But... That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Right, well, let's get the final mainline railway done and dusted. Right, so one more line. Line one. Leighton Buzzard. Ash. Whitby. What line's that going in? That's doing... It's doing commuter. Okay, so... Wade Bridge South. Then up to... Derby. Yep. And then... Starbridge. Hatfield. Hull. And then... Hatfield. Starbridge. 
Darby. Lady Bridge. Whitby. Ash, right now, how... Oh, I've got to go back up here to Hatfield to change the platforms it needs to go to. So Hatfield now needs to go to platform two. Starbridge platform three. Derby platform three. Hopefully this is going to work. Radio Bridge platform two. Whitby platform three. Ash uh, platform two. Let's just make sure that's worked. I like to think it's worked first time, but... Alright, let's go down here. Okay, right, how are we doing when it comes to that junction? Absolutely fine and dandy. Run it in. Straight in, no problems. Okay. Trust that's not the high speed line. Oh, good. Right. It's just a mess of things. Right, uh, new line. Nathan Buzzard. Ash. Whitby. Are you stopping at Derby? Yep, yeah, but you're not stopping at Starbridge. And then straight to Hull. And then... Back to Derby, platform one. Yep, nope, stop it. Then it's Whitby, Ash. Just make sure that's not going to cross over and do anything dumb. Lovely. Okay, so Midland Mainline Commuter. Middle of Mainline Express. Okay, right, so. Uh, what? Have you double slipped these? Yep, that's double slipped. That's double slipped. So, you need to follow. So. Um, oh, I need the symbols again. Uh, depot. Beautiful. Right, so I want that one. For com oh, was it commuter? Yeah, one number for commuter. So these are multiple units. I could go. I could go turbo star. I could do turbo star. I could. I might do that actually. Do you want to do that instead? Yeah, let's do that instead. Let's go with. Let's not. No, 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 no. Yes. Shall we? Tell you what, shall we do... No, ah, okay. Um... Do you want to... No, tell you what. Let's go with... That's French. It's Italian. Well, have I not got my own diesel? German diesels. There we are. Boom. This is going to look so out of place, but I don't particularly mind. Right, so where is. There we go. Right. So, one of you, one, two, three, four, and then I want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen of you, four, with the mainline commuter, beautiful, and then I want that one. Uh, these are HSDs. 
I don't think I've actually got anything to see Swallow set pre-made up. Nope, I shall make one. Right. Just see to Swallow forward. Right. Uh, where's me? There it is. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then there we go. Another one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The Mainline Express. Right. Now I believe I've actually got that uh, that name completely wrong. Oh, mis misspelt it. Yeah. Much better. Right. So let's have a look at how the Germans are doing, shall we? I've they do look completely out of place, I admit, but I think they look fantastic. Right, so. Uh, right, let's change the West Coast trains so we've got some more variety. So. Railway. Oh, no, I want vehicle condition, don't I? Um, yeah, because I've only just, ch I've only just done these. Right, let's do West Coast Intercity. Right, so, one, two, three, four, five, let's replace them, right, electric, you, you, back down we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, the hell? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, that's fine. Uh, don't actually think it gave me the D. Oh, it does give me DVTs in this. No, not the right ones. Uh, need to go down here to that one. Uh, DVT. Right. Let's replace them. Okay, take them off. And then, one, two, three, four, five. Create new. Right, back up we go to Intercity Swallow. Back down here. Rinse and repeat. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Back to there. To you. Spiffing. Beautiful. And then we are then going to go to this one. No, not electric multiple units. Stupid man. To city swallow. These things get dirty really quickly, but doesn't matter. Right, passenger. Tell you what we're going to do. We're going to have a mixture of intercity and virgin trains. So we're actually going to have virgin trains with the class 90s running around. And then I want should actually then give me West Coast variations. Yep. That's very short. 
That's also very short. Much better. Right, and we're going to want one, two, three, four, five of them. Set them on west coast into city. Make the line very crowded. But oh well. Right, okay, so that's now good. So. How do you want to work this? Let's. Okay, let's pause everything. If you do something like, let's do something like that, back up a bit, there we go. You're right, you have the planes coming, whoops, you'll have the planes coming in, you'll have the trains going out. I think we could be onto a winner here. So, tell you what, I'm not going to completely mute the sound, but I am going to turn it down on my end so I can just hear it. So hopefully it doesn't uh, pick up too bad on your side. The game volume should still stay the same. I'm just turning my desktop volume down. We're going to play. My turn up just a little bit. All right, got to 10 just so I can still hear things. VPN is turned off. Okay. Right, so, it may be a bit juttery, it's got a lot of things to try and load in now, because I've got the game paused for a while, but it's, uh, what, call it, call it 10 to, what, 10 minutes to go, so, okay, right, for the next 10 minutes, um, I'm going to shut up, we're going to do, you're going to just sit back, you can watch the trains coming and going, and uh, you can listen to the music, and then I'll do my outro, uh, in about 10 minutes time so uh, sit back and enjoy guys
Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, that actually went better than I thought. Plenty of variety in there. Uh, the HSTs were in a plenty. Through two ones coming back and forth. I think we caught all the Nova sets coming in. And we also had action at the airport as well. We had 747s coming in. We had aircraft passing overhead. We had absolutely everything. It was fantastic. With the German sets coming in. We also caught the uh, West Coast services coming in. That will be more uh, apparent as the, the days progress. But that was uh, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyable. Um, yeah, still plenty of need to, uh, to do the map. It's amazing. You sit in one place for X amount of time, then uh, you have to run around the map again to get everything loaded because so much has happened. But it's just... <laughs> oh, God, it's absolutely enormous. I mean, Tring alone... Tring is just absolutely fantastic. That's, that's grown so much. Ross on White again. You can see people living by the bloody airport. Oh, we've got a flyover. Yeah, this, this is um absolutely fantastic series so far. Uh, yeah, we've got the middle of main line done, up and running. Jobs are good at them. Um, yeah, I think I'll probably just start pottering with a few things. But I've got the Grand Central line I just want to plumb in. And I think I actually built the junction. Where did, I start? Where did I build the junction? I think I built the junction at Chester. So um, you're actually going to have the Grand Central lines pop off here, serve the cross-country platforms. Uh, they'll then disappear. Probably run... They'll probably run in conjunction with, with the cross-country route to Beaconsfield, to be fair. But uh, next time round... Uh, we're going to do the, the bus route, we're going to do the intercity bus route covering uh, Hull, Bellingarden Garden City, Camelford, Hocklington, into Bedford and Ross on Wye. After that, we're going to do the, uh, the tram from Hull, Hatfield, Stourbridge, Derby, Cardiff, into Camelford. Those will be the next two episodes. After that, um, probably get a few more bits of freight hooked up. I might actually do the freight. Um, off camera to be fair and you can see the finished result um, I'll probably actually upgrade the freight trains to more modern bits anyway but yeah we've now got some decent variety going we've got um, planes coming all over the place that's another that's the A380 isn't it yep that's the Lufthansa A380 coming in uh, yeah everyone is doing really really well let's um, just have a look at more icons let's just find out how the passenger numbers are doing if I can work out which one it is yep well, okay so stations just show up all the uh, all the bits so I might as well just do stations and um, bus stops because that gives a, a better indication we've got plenty of plenty of people waiting now uh, everything is to be seen absolutely everywhere I think every every line is yep high speed one's got plenty of passengers waiting as is the Transpennine route I don't think we actually saw the Eurostar when we were um, out and about, so I'll let it just do a little pass here for you. Here she comes. Nice and slow as she works her way in. Jolly good. So yes, there we go. That is uh, that is all she wrote. Uh, we've done plenty with the with the buses up there. I'll need to do some uh, some work with buses up there, but I think we're pretty close to doing what I set out to do initially, and that is just get every single town connected via one another. So at some point you'll be able to get from Cardiff to Wedding Garden City and so on and so forth. So you can get everywhere by plane, train, bus, car. And, uh, and boat. I mean, look at the airport here. It, look at the amount of people waiting. This is doing really, really well. Yeah, there's a fair few people waiting there. As I look at the airport, there's a lot of people waiting for. You see, I've got I've called some airlines EasyJet, even though it's not served by EasyJet, but we'll gloss over that. But look at Transcontinental. 93 passengers waiting, and that covers Transcontinental covers every single airport on the map. Oh, then we might get a fly past here.
that even got the F1 branding on it. There she goes, there's the shadow of the plane that's just had to pass overhead. The 747 has got priority. Away she goes. <laughs> right, well, let's go and uh, let's go to Hull. Let's go and find somebody to go and say goodbye to in Hull, shall we? Where do I want to go? Well, let's go outside the station. There's always going to be somebody waiting. Uh, right, whoops, Daisy, we've got a zombie in the form of Poppy Robinson. We've then got Leon Robinson, Jessica Young Watson, and Theodore Stewart. There we go. So, from those guys, the residents of Hull go into some far and distant land, and from myself, uh, I shall see you all later. I hope you enjoyed our little 10 minute session at Leighton Buzzard, just watching the trains going past. Those will probably be more of a regular thing. Um, yeah, off camera, I'm actually going to do, I'm going to probably set up. Uh, tons more freight off camera for you guys um, but the next on camera work will be the bus route and then after that it will be the tram uh, then the cross country route are the next three major ones and then probably just uh, upgrade the trains once more so we've got some proper more modern things running around um, and then that will probably be it because there will be uh, a lot happening on this map and it will just become quite resource intensive. Well, you, you can probably see because it's starting to slow down already. Um, the fact that all the towns are growing. Right, Mar Margate alone is just ridiculous. Living right on the level crossing. I actually need to upgrade the um, 321s that are in the first Great Eastern livery. But yeah, that is the uh, that is the plan, guys. So you know what the outlines are. Um, yeah, so I think we're doing good. So uh, until next time. I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.